I finally got my Erin Condred 2020 planner. Today is Monday. I don't know what day it is. <laughs> But it's like the middle of the week and I'm the middle of the month and I'm just getting my planner now and I'm so excited because I've been waiting for this for such a long time and I got it a few days ago but I didn't want to open it because I wanted to open it with you guys and yeah let me go get some knife or let me get something to open this box with gosh all right so this is the box that it comes with it says enjoy um very cute box this is what it looks like in the inside usually they have like something written up here at her very nicely wrapped very nicely wrapped Ooh, what is this happy birthday just a little something for, from whatever do you guys my birthday is in june just so you know just so you know it's in june but what is this happy but oh no, no 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 i guess it's like little little cards that you could give someone it's, um is it focusing why isn't it focusing it's like little cards that you could give someone and just a little something from you. Enjoy. Oh, this is cute. Showing me like the things that they have, right? Okay, so it ha comes with this little card right here. It says, welcome. Hello, welcome. Thank you. Enjoy these free gifts labels. Two sizes, blah, 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 blah. Okay, so it's free labels. All right, so you open up the package and oh, there's another little box here. It's nicely bubble wrapped because, you know, it has to be protected. Okay, so then this is a cute little other box. And I guess this slides out this way. Wow, the packaging is like really nice. Like, it's like, so cute. And then it comes nicely wrapped again. So pretty. Oh my God, this is huge. Let's put this aside. Look how pretty. And it's um, personalized, so you get to write your name. Here it has ruler. Um, I chose the watercolor. I chose the watercolor design. There's so many designs that you could choose from, but I don't know. This one stands it out more. You know what I should have done? I should have wrote 2020 here. I should have wrote 2020. Like my name and then 2020. Why didn't I think of that? Ugh. Anyway. And it's like, it's on paper, it's like laminated. So it's, ooh, ooh, and then it has like little stickers in here. Let's see. Okay, so then this is the planner. Get to, get to write stuff on it. And then you write your name on it. I wanna see the months. Oh, and it has like pretty, <laughs> Oh my god, the place. All right, so it says success, success means having the courage to become the person you believe you were meant to be. Very nice. It says 2019 to 2020. 2019? I don't know 2019. Okay, so then on this side, it has a calendar from July 2019. I know some of their planners. Why are you so? Hold on a second. Let me read you a little bit. Okay, so it has like a calendar. Let me see. Let me see. I know 
some of their planners start from July July to July. I don't know why that works that way. I listen, I'm just new to this whole planner thing and it's serious, all right? It is serious. They decorate well the girls decorate. Maybe you guys too. Well, people decorate their planners like till the nines. I mean like stickers everywhere, beautiful markers. I mean it's so pretty that I'm just learning this whole new world. So yeah, so then some planners come from July uh, July to July. Don't know why. But I ordered mine for 2020, only January to December. I guess this one with the little months came from July to December 2020. I'm not sure why it's like that, but it is. Flipping the page. Wow, these are nice and thick too. This is not cheap. Beginning the new mindset. Okay, so what I've seen for a lot of people is that they do one month per box and then they do their to-do list or their goals for that month and then flipping the page is like just notes passion and purpose gives you progress january 2020 okay so this one does start from january wow this is pretty so you write your like whatever you want to write <laughs> your goals or your cooking list or whatever it is. And then on this side, you write birthdays, monthly goals, and then extra notes. And then over here you have your regular calendar, which today is, okay, today's the 20th. Martin Luther King, today's the 20th. And yeah, okay, so what? Okay, so we're in January, okay, 2020. I flip the page and it's December 2018. I don't know what happened here. Oh, oh, okay, 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 okay. Okay, I know, I know exactly what happened. So January, they gave us two extra days for December and then this goes back to January, I'm guessing. So weird. What? I don't get it. I'm new to this thing. I don't get it. But so far I love the colors. I love everything in it. I think there must have been something wrong here because I thought it starts with January, I mean with December and then January, and then it went back to this, and then this, which this makes sense, which I thought it was a previous page, previous, previous, previous page. <laughs> I don't know, I'm all over the place. Anyway, December and then January, which is what I thought, I guess, in January, okay. I think they just put like an extra page in there. All right, and then we go to February. The comeback is always stronger than the setback. Yes, February. Again, the same layout, which is birthdays, goal, monthly goals and blank spaces, and so on and so on for each month. Very pretty, very pretty. Now, I got the colorful one. You could also get this in just regular, um, like grayish color, but I like the colors. Very pretty. And then on the back, once you pass December, they you have your little notes tab right here, and then they give you like extra pages, which is so pretty. I'm so happy. I can't wait to start using it and start. Oh, look, and it has like. They give you like extra sheets to color. Mm, you can get creative with this. Maybe put like little goals here. Let me see. 
So it's 12, 12 of them. Maybe you could, I don't know, maybe set like little goals back here and then check them out. Like check them once you completed them. This one is for your contacts. I don't know if anybody still writes down their contacts. Usually they're on your phone, but hey, it's a good idea to just keep them somewhere because nowadays nobody remembers no one's phone numbers. It's just you're so dependent on phone now that I think it's a good idea to just write them down. You never know what might happen to your phone. And flipping through the pages, again, we have the calendars here and I came across the stickers. They're just so pretty. And you could just put stickers everywhere in your calendar. Oh my gosh, these are so nice. Oh my gosh, I love them. And then these look like little tabs. A little folder in the back. Oh, what's this? Celebrate, celebrate everyone or something every single day. What is this? What is this? Oh, it's a little calendar and contacts. So it's like a tiny, a tiny one. I guess so you could keep in your bag. It's getting blurry. Focus. Yes, it's one for each month. I'm not gonna focus in. So it's a little, like a little tiny little planner or like little to keep notes. It has numbers on the side, so it's like for every day. Super cute. I love it. I love it, you guys. And it comes with this ruler here. Um, like this real well. Very cute, you guys. I'm super happy with my planner. Wish I could have rolled 2020. If you're planning to order a planner for yourself or you have a planner, let me know what type of planners do you have. I want to see like what's out there. So far, I've seen this one and the happy planner, but I was more. I don't know, something about this planner just spoke to me. So I went ahead and ordered this one, but so far I'm loving it. I can't wait to start using it. I started, I subscribe to a lot of people that are into planning and it's just like so mesmerizing to just like look at how they plan things and they put stickers all over their month and they check things off and it's everything so organized. So. That's one of my goals for this year, just to like keep everything written down because I feel like I keep everything in my head. I'm like, why do I need a planner? I know I have everything in my, phone, in my head. I write everything on my phone, but I want to, I want to visualize, like I want to see what I'm doing every single day and checking off and doing the do list. And I also want to get better at cooking. So maybe I could write some re recipes here and yeah so yeah you guys so that's it this is it for my unboxing and review I love it I can't wait to start using it and yeah I hope you like this video let me know what you think in the comments down below thank you so much for watching and I will see you next time